Hey guys, hope you all are doing good. And I am making with uh, this video to inform you that the uh, forms for TIFR, uh, you know, edit an exam has already been out. And uh, <clears throat> uh, if you Google even GS 2022 TIFR exam, uh, you will get this kind of page. Okay. And the thing is, this exam generally like uh, you will uh, the students will be admitted in the 2022 year so that's why the exam name is gs 2022 though the written exam will be in december 2021 so and uh, the people who want to apply for integrated phd programs or phd programs are uh, can apply to this okay and uh, they will be admitted into tfr institutes uh, so you can check out okay uh, and i will tell you some important uh, you know uh, links and dates what are important dates and how to uh, apply also we can check out if you want to check out about you want to know about tfr what are the you know departments are there you can go to this section and you will get this kind uh, this many institutes uh, like what are the departments okay you you can even go for school of mathematics also you can you will get this kind of page so you can check out okay these all are the links like there are so tfr centers are there so not only tfr mumbai or tfr hyderabad there are other institutes also like there are uh, for center for applied mathematics that is in bangalore so they are ncbs in bangalore so these are all are affiliated to tfr only so there are so many uh, departments you can check out all these things and then uh, so and accordingly you can apply for your area okay so now for exam for our uh, what like gs 2022 you can check out these important dates uh, so <clears throat> exam will be uh, written exam will be on december 12 2021 um it will be on sunday and online application has already been started from 8 october last date is 7 november um, and you can download your admit card on november 22 okay and yeah there is a window uh, like through gate you can apply okay gate score and that will open on january 31 2022 and the results for the written exam that will be conducted on uh, december 12 2021 will be out by end january 2022 so you will be uh, able to know like you whether you have been selected for the interviews or not second round that is second round actually so now this was the thing and now test timings so for these fields physics chemistry computer and system sciences and biology uh, it will be in the morning session from 9:30 am to 12:30 pm so it will be 3 hours 3 hours exam and for biology people it will be in the afternoon session and it will be a 2 hour exam from 2:30 pm to 4:30 pm and for mathematics it will be in afternoon session but it will be a 3 hour exam 2:30 pm to 5:30 pm so these were the uh, timings test timings okay so now comes the eligibility eligibility section so just see and check your eligibility criteria uh, if you want to apply for phd um, you should have msc or ma like that and for integrated phd these are your eligibility criteria similarly for other fields also you can check out in this section and another thing is they have not mentioned any age related eligibility so you can apply okay and now comes admission procedure that is for the, you can check out for different institutes also what are the participating institutes like who will take uh, who which institutes will take through this exam you can check out okay and uh, after that uh, there is fellowship okay so for phd students they will receive uh, 31000 per month a monthly fellowship and plus hra and when after registration of phd they can get 35000 per month for integrated phd they will receive monthly fellowship of rupees 21000 plus hra in the first year and upon satisfactory performance the that uh, fellowship will be enhanced to 31000 per month okay plus hra and after registration for phd it will be further raised to 35000 per month 
and yeah there are some section like for msc also msc in biology if you want to apply they will get a monthly fellowship for rupees 16000 per month plus hra uh, msc in wildlife biology and conservation they will get rupees 20 12000 fixed so no hra in that so you can check out these fellowships also okay and there is an opportunity for overseas students also. They also can apply in some departments like physics, biology and if they want to inquire about other subjects which are not mentioned here, they can write a mail to this email ID. Okay. And there are download section. In this download section, you can get previous year all papers and syllabus and sample question papers. This you also can get through this link also syllabus and qp means question papers so syllabus or sample papers you can uh, get here or old question papers okay so now see what is application application procedure is online like through online you only have to apply then what is application fees for male candidate it is 1200 for female it is 600 and for others also 600 and application fees can be paid online okay then there is an uh, opportunity, uh, we can say there is an window where, <clears throat> so there is one opportunity, I will say, um, there is one good thing also, like some people who are having some financial problems or something, they can apply for application fee waiver, uh, but they should get one uh, that sh uh, they should get a letter requested from the principal or HOD which will justify the request and then while filling the form you will get uh, one option you may click on uh, then on the fee waiver option and you can upload that scan copy of this letter so you might you you can get the fee waiver okay so this is also and then you can apply through this uh, click by clicking on this apply online you just see all these things and then you can go downside and you can just click on this apply online then this page will appear and it will take i think one or two minutes to upload so wait for that now you will get this thing kind of thing you can close this you can just check out once what they are saying and then close and then start filling the forms okay and this is first step is registration after that you will get some registration id and then you have to log in into um, that so through this also you can apply like student login okay so here also from here also you can apply like apply online you will get the same page okay and apply online again okay then if you have already registered like first step you have done this step you have done you got uh, some information about your registration details in your email provided email id so you will get this uh, you can go to I already register click here to login into your account you will get you can use your user id and password and login into and then fill the rest of the form and if any of you are facing any problem while filling the form you can go to contact information contact info and you can see the uh, they have provided some mail ids and telephone numbers so you can contact them and uh, like you can attach your uh, screenshot of the problem uh, and send them through mail so this was from my side and i hope um, you all do best in the exam so all the best